The Brainerd boys basketball team begins their season tomorrow night, but this year they're showing up as an almost completely new squad. The Warriors returning are returning only two players this season, and they know they're going to have to rely on strengths other than experience to have a successful season. Taylor Archer has more. Defense is the foundation of this program, so naturally practice started with defensive drills. We've been in the last six years in the top 10 or 12 in the state and points allowed, so that says something about them buying in uh, to that. So it's been a lot on the defensive side. To also prepare for tomorrow night, the Warriors have invested much of their time watching film to learn from their mistakes from past seasons. We just look at some of the old stuff, some of the simple mistakes we made from last year and the years before, and we're just going to put that together this year, and we're just going to polish that stuff up. The team is younger and smaller in size this year, but Coach Stanfield and his players agree that their ability to stay within themselves and not do too much on the court will help them this season. I would definitely say our speed and our ability to shoot outside, and just we've been able to work really well together, and I think we're going to use that to our advantage. A lot of them, uh, this will be their first varsity experience. Uh, they're plenty capable, they're extremely talented, so I'm not worried about uh, that part of it. I'm worried about uh, how they handle the pressure of, of facing these stronger kids all the time. In order to handle the pressure of playing at a higher level, the younger guys have the seniors to look up to. We welcome with open arms, and we, if, they ha if they have a question, we help them answer it. And if they have any problems, they come to us and we help them through it, you know, it's just like what teams usually do. And this team knows that as long as they bring their defense, their offense will come as well. In Brainerd, Taylor Archer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.